You're looking at a very interesting image that can be doctored quite dramatically with a program that is uh, being distributed by our guest today. He is from Graphic Systems USA, which is headquartered in Portland, Oregon. His name is Steve Beck, and the program that we're talking about specifically is called Imagaro Z, and we're about to find out more about exactly what it can do and how this is really going to be such a help to people in the graphics industry, especially sign makers and people who do things with graphics, right, on a, on a major large scale. That's right. People who work with graphics on a regular basis, this will really be a benefit to them. All right, we've talked about it. Let's get a demonstration now. As we've pointed out, this has both a, a PC, a Windows version, and the Macintosh version. We're doing yeah. this with a Mac. This is a they do look. I'm sorry, they, do, they, do, they do, do look the same on both Macintosh and PC. They're both the same. Okay. Yes, so. Talk to me a little bit, Steve, and tell me, uh, let's just show some examples of how versatile this program is and actually what it can do. Okay, here we have a low-resolution bitmap file. This could be like the East Side Blue Devils logo. Okay. Do is we're going to show you how quickly we can clean this up. We can come over here, and you, this will open up JPEGs, GIFs, TIFFs, BMPs, PICs, or bring in graphics from a scanner. We just okay. come over here, and we're going to click Vectorize. And one click of our mouse there, and we're going to come up here and we'll view that uh, in its uh, fill there. And zoom back there, and you can see we have just removed all that stair-stepped look. We have a nice sharp image that now can be resized, that can be reduced to the size of a dime or blown up to the size of a mural on the side of a building. It's going to look just as nice. And it did that in, in a f seconds? One click of a mouse. Just one click of a mouse. On this particular image, yes. You make it sound so simple. Is it really that simple? It's, uh, it is a very easy to use interface. People that work in the graphic industry are, are going to feel quite at home because of a lot of the tools in vector graphics, whether it be uh, Corel Draw or Adobe Illustrator or, or Macromedia Freehand, they're all very similar. In this operation. works with all of them. Then. Yeah, this is a standalone program, right. but the results can be exported and brought into any of the major graphic design softwares. Let's go have okay. some more demonstrations. We'll, we'll take Show me a, some more. Some more uh, of its capability. Well, we'll take that other image that you that we have here. The uh, this is a 24 kilobyte GIF image, something like you might uh, get off the internet. Let me open that up, and here I'm going to zoom in here so you can see the uh, pixelation on this. You can see a really fuzzy edge there. I don't know if you can see that. Uh, let me yeah, zoom in real close there. Start to see it. Yep. There we go. We yep, start yep, seeing yep. where something like that. You attempt to resize it, and you're going to lose a lot. Well, we're just going to go over here, and we'll process that, and it will separate out the colors. Now, this is something that been scanned uh, on a yes. scanner. It could have been downloaded off the Internet. This maybe? particular graphic here is an Internet, internet, internet graphic. An internet yes. download. Okay. 24 kilobyte. It's right. going to hit process, and we're going to vectorize. And now we've got a nice, sharp vector image that can be resized. If I zoom back in here, you're going to see that we have nice, sharp edges and those sharp edges will maintain uh, no matter what size you put that. That's so fast. Create this graphic. You could go through and, and identify just exactly what the typeface is and actually replace with that typeface if a, if a person has the license to that particular font. I would call that clean as a whistle, wouldn't you? It does make a difference. It's, boy, it makes a dramatic difference. And here's what it looks like when you do a sign of some size here. I mean, this is, uh, this is beautiful. This would work. Now, if it hadn't undergone this and, process, it would be... And the thing is, you could exciting. then take that graphic and blow it up to any size. You could blow that up big enough to put on the size of a billboard or the side of a building, okay. and it would look just as sharp. So, when it comes right down to it, what are the big benefits of this program? Well, the benefits of the program for the graphic industry is that, is that you can um, uh, reduce, to a large degree, the bottleneck, oftentimes, that it's created in a graphic department by poor quality art. Uh, keep that production going through. I mean, uh, the graphic industry is a is a service industry. We're serving other com uh, other companies, you right, know, by right. by uh, producing products to help them promote themselves. And oftentimes, it's very time sensitive for for different events. And so it's time and money. It is time and money. Time, bottom line, saves money and That's it gives right. you a better product. That's right. What do you call it? We haven't really mentioned the name of oh, what the, this program is. The program is, is called Imagaro Z. Well, it's a great story. Wish you great success with it.